Hello YouTube, this is my newest edition, oh it's not new but the PCB is new and uh, this is my old new scope with my new PCB and you will notice that it's the new ones from now on because I have a new logo and there were a little changes made to the PCB, to the layout, to the pins and most notably was the SMA connector pads for the antenna did I show this before? I don't remember could be so this one goes on here like this now and it's holding by itself plus it gets soldered too anyhow so anyhow this is my new PCB and this is my new Olinio scope I will now from now on make the videos with taking the protective screen off because it looks so much nicer if it's off anyhow as you can see in the background I have my previous scope in a case which does not fit quite right because the LEDs are on the front so actually this case was designed by a customer of mine and this here along with four other ones go to him and he's gonna make or adjust the case for the new PCB also as you can see here the switch moved down a little bit as to the previous version so he will fix all that and uh, I will for people who don't have a 3D printer I will offer the cases for sale also and you could get them in PLA in this color which is supposed to be red but it's actually more orange than red and I will have it in silver ABS black ABS, transparent and glow in the green uh, glow in the green, <laughs> glow in the dark green so I will mo mostly make the back black the front silver or transparent or glow in the dark green and you can have it any way you want but I think this is, I always liked this because it was so thin but holding it in your hand like this is of course not optimal and with a case like this it's just so much nicer and this case was only my I think my fourth or fifth print on the printer so without much uh, adjusting and configuring the printer yet because I will rebuild the printer so anyhow this was that and I had another test with ABS and I have some artifacts here which I don't know why they happened let me show you like here it's like too much ABS came out and then it just ripped it's like too much paint when it runs down so I don't know if that happened because the temperatures was too high or what the exact reason was of course I know depending what slicer you use you get much different results but this was also pretty nice and it's flat no warping anyhow this is my new Holdinho scope and let me quickly hook it up so I can show it the pinout did change a little bit before positive and negative was next to each other now it's on the outsides and that done. 
so yeah, you can see it the OLED display in its full glory anyhow the from now on the new updated versions will be on sale on Tindy of course so thanks for watching I hope I did not bore you too much and thanks for watching take care